again in the Nichi Deka. The commissioning of the borehole water project was graced by the presence of the parliament representative for the area. Villagers and local dignitaries from the surrounding communities were also represented. After welcoming remarks by the village head, the member of parliament, Pamodu Jata, on behalf of the entire residents of Darubusumbala, thanked the Gamal team for this great gift and assured them that good care will be given. I would like to thank you very much. Uh, I'm telling you that we appreciate your benevolent gesture you have done for Daru Busumbala. You know, this community has been in this water crisis for so long. So through your intervention, you know, now that is a history. They will take great care of this thing and they will contribute something so that when anything happens, they can do the maintenance and, and I wish you success in whatever you do. The provision of this great gift to this community has brought joy and happiness that only equates to the welcoming of newborn baby. I quote your motto, and our fellow men will believe, unquote. The rest assured that utmost care shall be given to this magnificent project. We pray to the Creator, we trust to shower his abundant blessings to your organization and the residents more in Belgium and Daru Busumbala of four Gamal's intervention. This mass movement of people is bringing in its wake the rapid spread of disease and infection and placing a strain on our health facility. Going by the Memorandum of Understanding agreed between the Gamma Family Planning Association and Gamma, a nurse midwife was assigned to the project site during installation to attend to those who requested for medical attention. After conducting a health talk on personal hygiene, North Spa screened and dispensed drugs to the needy. How will you rate Gamos overall intervention in this village? <laughs> How many patients were you able to screen during these few days you have been here? And we've been screening something like 112 patients. That's what I've seen up to date. And uh, some of the cases I am seeing are uh, the majority are skin infections, eye infections, chest problems. Their treatments is coming from Gamal. The project is giving these drugs free. They come in, we screen them, and then we give them treatment. And your perception about this water project? Looking at the cases they have here, health-wise, water plays a very significant role. Like skin infections, eye problems, Eye problems, the majority of eye cases they have, is related to poor sanitary conditions. And when they have this water, I believe that they will make the best use of it. The skin infections, if they are taking daily bath, I know it will minimize or reduce much of it, as well as eye infection. Flies will have to run away. Flies, are, they are vectors of so many diseases in, in this country, especially eye infections. So I believe that they will make best use of this. They've come at the right time for this community because definitely they need it very seriously. Are the drugs provided by Gamal taking care of the cases you have come across? I would say no because, you know, tropical infections, 
especially with skin infections, you need ointments. You need certain type of antibiotics for the children we do not have. Especially here, the community do not have access to help. Very close to them, no. They are a little bit far away from health facilities. So you will see that children below one year do not have, it should be syrups, they do not have syrups. It's one year and above and they did not cater for um, uh, uh, treatment for some of these skin infections. So you would see that I would try to change the treatment regime to other ones and then try to refer other cases. And then I am seeing cases here that are medical cases that I cannot handle in this clinic. So I have referred. I've had two feedbacks. One is a diabetic one. I suspected looking at the signs and symptoms of the patient. And the other one, looking at the signs and symptoms of the patient, was a high blood pressure. And I referred them, they came back, they brought their results. They, they definitely need treatment from outside this box. Yes. The intention of your organization is to provide clean, fresh drinking water to 250,000 Gambians by 2015. How far are you from achieving your goal? Uh, for the moment, uh, these two villages included, we are almost at 150,000 already. So uh, the counter is going in a good direction and we are sure that we are going to manage this thing uh, before 2015. Is Gamal offering only water to Gambians? Trying to help local health centers. Uh, we provide them with the uh, necessary medication and things that we can uh, bring from Belgium, even like beds or mattresses. Uh, since last year, we have a very close cooperation. Join us on our, during our works here in different villages. We provide them with the necessary medications and they help the people with it. How many boreholes have Gamo put in place? And where are they located? Uh, we have two boreholes in Nabucco. We have two in Sanyang, we have one in Kunkujang, one in Mamuda, and one in Sambuya. Thanks to the intervention of Gamo, a Belgium-based NGO with participatory headquarters at Kombo Sayang Village, West Coast region of the Gambia, for drilling a borehole for the villagers, Darubusumbala can now boast of having clean, portable water for all domestic purposes providing a pipe bond drinkable water for the residents of this village is a wonderful gesture by your organization do you think running this system on generator will be sustainable by the community or are you thinking about an alternative power source this generator is here temporarily the plan is to fix a solar system for them and all the solar panels are right now in my office but we are testing the system with this generator. What changes have this water system brought to this village? Water project was graced by the presence of the parliament representative for the area. Villagers and local dignitaries from the surrounding communities were also represented. After welcoming remarks by the village head, the member of parliament, Pamodujata, on behalf of the entire residents of Darubusumbala, thanked the Gamal team for this great gift and assured them that good care will be given. I would like to thank you very much. Uh, I'm telling you that we appreciate your benevolent gesture you have done for Daru Busumbala. You know, this community has been in this water crisis for so long. So through your intervention, you know, now that is a history. They will take great care of this thing and they will contribute something so that when anything happens, they can do the maintenance and, and I wish you success in whatever you do. The provision of this great gift to this community has brought joy and happiness that only equates to the welcoming of newborn baby. 
I quote your motto, and our fellow men will believe, unquote. The rest assured that utmost care shall be given to this magnificent project. We pray to the Creator, we trust to shower his abundant blessings to your organization and the residents more in Belgium and Daru Busumbala. Thank you.